we're at home, right? We're po practicing our social distancing, we're staying safe, we're confined to our home. What can we do to get a little bit better at baseball? Like I said in the first videos, um, it's not about throwing the ball or being out on a field that always matters. Building a foundation and how do we do that? That's with our legs, right? That's our stability. We want balance when we're pitching. So there's ways to practice that right in the comfort of your own home. I'm in the kitchen. You know, maybe mom and dad don't want you in the kitchen, but that's where I'm choosing today. So little drills that we can do as simple as this. It's building a foundation for your mechanics so that you're strong. You always hear the saying ball of foot to ball of foot. And that's about going from the ball of your feet, which are right here. And as you pick up, you go from one ball of foot to the other and land balance. You want your direction going home plate this way. So a simple exercise I can do is get into your stretch position, right? Like you're pitching with somebody on base, because let's face it, the most important pitches you're gonna throw are always with somebody on base. So as we get there into our set position, all we're gonna do is pick up like this and hold that and hold it and practice that. That's strength, that's what you wanna do. And then if you want, you can release and go down into your mechanics like that, right? Coming up like this and then down into your mechanics like that. And if you want, what you can do is you can do it by reps. Try to do five reps or 10 or 15 and then go into multiple sets of that. So what I'm doing is I'm going like this. Boom, boom, boom. And then you really want to build up strength as you can do it and hold it. Hold it for a five second count, a 10 second count, 30 seconds. See if you can hold it for a minute. If you're really advanced, the more you do this along the line, it's the time you're sitting there in your room in front of a mirror, practicing your mechanics, hold it for five minutes. Challenge yourself to get as strong as you can in that position. Same thing for lefties on the other side. I have bad left-handed mechanics, so I'm not even going to attempt. Now, something that I did as a teenager that helped me out that's even a little bit more advanced when we talk about this. Creating a little bit of a challenge for ourselves. And that's a simple two by four. Now, where do they get a two by four in the kitchen? Easy, the pantry, who doesn't have one in there? What we do is we lay the two by four down, like that, and now we're putting a little bit more of a little monkey wrench into our plants, but it's good, and we're practicing balance on the two by four. So same thing, right? Boom, boom, holding it up there, and then going like that, and then pushing off. Now you wanna take it one step further. This is for the real advance. You get that two by four out nice and straight like that, you stand on it, like I said, ball of foot, right? That's where your balance point's gonna be. Whew, let's see if I can do this. I haven't done this in a while. Boom, like that, hold it there, and then see if you can come down and land on it. And then get back up. Whoa, that's a tough one. All right. Looks like I know what I'm gonna be doing over the next few weeks. Boom, and then boom, and landing on there. And just practicing that. You're practicing stability, you're practicing strengthening those muscles and your glutes and your quads, your ball of foot, ball of foot balance, and that gives you good direction going to home plate, good balance so you can get up on top of the baseball and behind it when you get downhill.